Hello guys, today I will show you one way how to avoid duplicate queries in Filament to avoid so-called n plus one query problem from Laravel. And this is a story how I help someone on Discord by recreating their project locally. So here's the initial question and scenario. So there's a table column and in that column the author wants to show the relationship parent of a parent. So two level up with the name and generally you can use a function called format state using to format the value of any column but please please avoid eloquent queries inside of that callback function because then for every row of the table you will have another query to the database which is potentially a huge performance issue that's why the author created this topic asking for help so if we're not supposed to run a query here where do we run it then what if i told you that filament does it automatically for you here's my filament project which i recreated for this scenario and here's the table the resource of jobs and in the database it's this name of the job and then there's speciality id but speciality is a table that has a parent for example there's it speciality and then there are children like programming web design or whatever and the relationship is to this row but what we need to show in the table is this value of it so parent of the speciality and if we define the model relationships correctly then filament will do that for us automatically so here's the relationship from job to speciality belongs to and then in the speciality model we have another relationship parent since the function name and the model name is different it's a relationship to itself we need to specify foreign key column as well and then what we do on filament level it's just this so we don't need any format state using any special query or anything like that we just make a text column of relationship dot relationship dot column to level up it will still work without any extra queries and to see the queries under the hood i have installed laravel debug bar which you can do by compose or require barry vdh laravel debug bar and then at the bottom you have this bar with queries and if we zoom it in we have two queries for specialities one query for any specialities that would be for children and then another one query for all the specialities that need the relationship of a parent which means that no matter how many rows of jobs we have in this table there will be still two queries let's actually prove it design job number two let's save that record refresh the table in the table we have three rows as you can see but the queries show still two queries so yeah filament does so-called eager loading for us automatically avoiding n plus one query problem and duplicate queries and my general advice for filament would be to always have laravel debug bar installed locally and check the amount of queries for your tables because by doing a lot of magic things in filament you may accidentally run too many queries so it's always good to check that just in case. If you want more videos on Filament, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to support my mission of shooting videos and other content around Filament, check out our premium product, filamentexamples.com. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.